Antonio, Texas. We did stop in San Antonio. We stopped in San Antonio last night and stayed at a room because we didn't want to go over his DOT hours. The room was extremely nice, you guys, but it was so much going on yesterday that I didn't vlog it. I didn't get anything. And the room was fucking amazing. As you can see, I have switched out, changed out wigs. This is a brand new wig, actually, he just bought me. Um, I didn't even have time to do anything to it this morning, you guys. The only thing I did was basically, uh, like, glued it down with my got-to-be, but I didn't have time to do shit else. Um, I'm talking kind of loud because I got the windows down, and I don't know if you guys can hear me or not. Come on. And actually, I also bleached my knots last night, but girl, honey child, let me tell you, why the fuck I let my, cause it got a Swiss lace on the unit, you guys, and why the hell I let it overprocess? so now we're walking around with a blind car and blind edges, it's me, but I am gonna fix it, I know how to fix it, but unfortunately, I just didn't have time this morning before we left the room. We woke up with a very, very, very late start. We had a very long day yesterday, you guys. Uh, as you know, I'm drinking green tea, not coffee. Um, me and him had like a dispute, a spit spat yesterday, so it took up so much time and energy of yesterday, from yesterday, from really getting anything done, honey. And you know, I'm gonna tell y'all the truth to shame the devil, honey, because no relationship is perfect, especially mine. It is work, 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 work. Like Rihanna said, consistent work. More work than a goddamn job. Yesterday, once we got to where we were going, you guys, and got settled into the room and things of that nature, it was about 3, 3 o'clock after we left the hair store and all that good stuff. But it just really wasn't a good day at all. So, we wasted we wasted so much time like kind of like just arguing and fucking off that it was ridiculous we didn't get shit done yesterday so now we're leaving uh san antonio texas which is gorgeous by the way like fucking gorgeous if i could move here uh and live anywhere in texas it would probably 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 be i can't even say the shit right it would probably be san antonio texas but i also love plano as well plano is extremely nice plano texas Sorry, I'm thirsty. And trying to wake my ass up for this long ass ride. We still have four hours and 15 minutes ahead of our asses. His GPS say five hours. Mine say four. He like, well, my, why mine say five? I'm like, shit, probably because you in that slow ass truck. And I'm in this rental. And I know this motherfucker can get me there fast if I wasn't falling behind your ass. But whatever. And so, yeah, that's that. I'm going to turn the air on just for a little bit. But I hope you guys can still hear me. But yeah, San Antonio is.
uh, work hours, they be leaving them signs up. It probably was up from last night, but they ass ain't doing nothing today, so shit. But yeah, about a mile back, that's why everybody started getting, getting over, because about a mile back, it said right shoulder close the head, so shit, everybody started getting over. So I was like, shit, should we get over too? But it's open, so that must have been from last night or some shit. I don't know, baby. It do, it do feels pretty good to just be rolling right now, but I really need to take this Tylenol, and I don't want them to eat my liver, because ain't nothing on my stomach. My head is killing me. Like, I just need a burger, but I want a good burger. I don't know, because we kind of rolling right now. It's after one o'clock, honey. We ain't gonna get there until I don't know when. I really would hate to stop. That's why I said I wanted to eat before we even start rolling. We just got a late start today, and yesterday was kind of fucked up, but hopefully it gets better from here. I don't know. You what? Right. We don't want to get off and just end up eating anything. But do you see how fucking nice San Antonio is? Oh my God, just look left and look right, honey. It's it's super nice, ain't it? Yeah. Okay, well, anyway, yeah, whatever, whatever's good and decent, I, I just need something real fast. Because I know if I eat now, I could go for like the next two hours on the road, you know? But I have to eat. I need to take this time out like right now. All right. All right, babe, I'm right behind you. I'm following you. So whenever you see something get off, I'm getting off too. Because you, you can see more of what's coming ahead than I am sitting up that high. Yeah. Look, they're gonna sign right there and say food next right, but I don't know about that shit. I know. With nothing on that sign that I would've got probably but Chick-fil-A. And neither one of us fans of that. But we do need something just simple and quick though, right? And cheap. Like we ain't trying to eat no restaurant food. Should we get Chick-fil-A and just keep it pushing? I don't know, but on that sign back there it said food exits coming up. And it's a lot of shit right here. Look to your right. Yeah, but it's a full egg. Oh, there it go. To the right. Oh, this will be our exit. It. Yep. This all the food we passing it right now. I don't know what to say, babe. Just pay attention to the C. Now it's a food next right, but it's a Popeye's. Shit, you want that? All right, just get off on the next exit. We'll just grab some Popeye's and call it a day. Shit. All right. Okay, bye. That was a long ass talk, Ninja. I'm starting to get hot up in here. Where my air? Ooh, child. Got my breast is just sweating. Oh, not to the night nice shot. Yeah. Okay, Siri, and whatever else it is that we're about to do, but oh my God, I wish I could just 
give y'all a glimpse of San Antonio. It is so fucking gorgeous and so super nice. A slight left turn onto Texas 1604 Loop West now. Oh my God, look at that traffic. Even when we, after we do eat and we get back on the highway, we are about to be in so much traffic. I don't know what to say or do. Like, we fucked up. We might not be able to do nothing this weekend as far as having fun because it's just not good at all. This is not good at all. I wish I could just show you guys the traffic. This is crazy. Oh, my God. We are barely moving. Oh, my God. This is crazy. My eyes is to the left. I see that now. Oh, no. There's a lot going on, honey. A lot. A lot. A lot. A lot. I'm taking my time. I'ma beat him to Popeyes because he's in his big ass. Oh, honey. Maybe I see this traffic is crazy. Look at my blind edges. I need to cover them up the best way possible. So I am going to do that in a minute, but it's crazy out here. Unbelievable. <laughs> If you've never been out of town or in a different state and didn't know what the fuck was going on and then you just like ran into some shit by accident and just like, what the fuck? That's how it feels right now. He texting and shit. He ain't paying attention, so. Who just got in front of his ass is me. I need my air on. It is hot as hell out here in Texas. And it's steady going up, honey. It's 76. I'm looking at the houses in the mountains. We just rolled through a rolled through a mountain. You see they had to cut it out for the road. Okay. Bye. Open. Look at the mountains. That's crazy. You know I do mountains. 
is crazy. Welcome back, beauty gang, 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 beauty gang, fam, fam. But right now, you guys, currently, we have actually, finally, 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 finally made it out of um, San Antonio, Texas. We have been riding through all kind of little cities in Texas, so, okay, Siri, shut up. Basically, we just passed through, I want to say Junction, Texas, and I kind of gave you guys a glimpse of, a clip, a glimpse of things. And while we were riding through there, it was very, very hilly, very mountainish through that motherfucker and whatnot. And um, good little snip clip of some of the mountains as we were rolling through there and just some of the traffic and cars or whatever passing through. But it really wasn't much to see. Again, long story oh, yeah. short, we're back on the road. We're just still no, we're 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 done with. Oh my god. I ain't never seen no lamb. Like, I gotta see motherfuckers with goats and cat. I mean, not goats. I done seen motherfuckers with horses and uh, cattle and whatnot. But child, I just passed some uh, lamb, some sheep. You know, bad, bad. I just saw a lamb full of those shit. Ain't on my smart, smart popcorn right now. We just stopped at another truck stop. And I also got me some fruit, some watermelon to keep a bitch juicy and, and hydrated and, you know, alive. Feed my electric lights. I should have got me a damn Gatorade, but I didn't. So yeah, guys, long story short, that's the only thing that's going on right now. And I'm riding through some more damn mountains right now as we speak. And it's so hilly and so steep through here. It's crazy. Oh, it's Street Pop Thompson. That's my last name. And we're just about to get back on the road, you guys. And basically keep rolling, 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 rolling. I love my new wig. It is so soft. And I just washed it last night, so it smells stupid good. Where is this nigga taking me? Oh, Suri said there's a connected road through here. So he got us rolling through the hood and shit. You know what I mean? This new ass nice says, Brandon, we better not get right up. I'm just kidding. That's about it, guys. Back on the road we go. So country through here? I would know with my country ass. I'm just a country girl living in a really, really big country world. No, I'm just a country girl living in a really, really big city world. Yeah, but this connected road just leads us right back onto the highway, you guys. So, and now we're back rolling, 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 rolling. We're gonna make a right up here somewhere. According to Siri. Make a slight right turn onto North US Highway 277. Okay, you got it. Make a slight right turn now. Yes, ma'am. 10 4. We're gonna make a left. Once we get so far up, I guess. Oh my god, it's mountains through here. I know. Turning, boot thing. I'm turning, honey. She is turning. We are currently passing through Sonora, Texas. It's real hilly too. Y'all got all kind of mountains and shit. Sure. Bitch, wanna pull it down? Come on, ho. Trying to keep up with my man. Trying to keep up with my man. There's ma'am. It's so fucking hilly through here. I'm going up a hill just to go on my way. It's crazy. My country ass used to them flatlands. Proceed on the 10 West. Yes, ma'am. But uh, the amazing part about it is, you all, there is no, absolutely no traffic out here right now. It's just smooth fucking sailing. The only bad part is it's 6 o'clock in the evening and our asses should have been gone. And it's still saying that we're two hours out from our actual destination. Um, so, child, we ain't gonna get there until, what, six? 
7, 8 o'clock-ish, which that's just leading us into the actual city or town where we'll be. And then Bay still has to make it to the actual job site and drop off his work truck and trailer, which according to his GPS on his Apple iPad, is still saying that that's like a whole freaking hour, another hour away from once we actually enter through the city, I mean, through the town, so I don't know, y'all. By the time we make it to our final destination, the bitch is gonna be tired. Sleepy and home. I don't know what the plan is gonna be because the point of me saying all this is because we're supposed to be um, trying to drive like halfway to Nevada tonight. That way we can spend the weekend there and then just drive back like Monday, first thing Monday morning because he's off until Tuesday. But honey child, let me tell you, according to the way my ass feels, just sitting and riding found these hours. And I got a slight baby headache. And I don't know, I just didn't get much rest or much sleep last night. I'm just really not up for it right now. Like, don't get me wrong, don't get it fucked up. I would love to go, I would love to be there. But like right now, where we are right now, being two hours out away from our destination, it should be like noon. You get what I'm saying? For us to make good time to head to Vegas. So right now, I'm just kind of not even in the mood. And he's driving too, so man, like one of us is resting while the other one is driving. No, bitch, we both driving right now. I know by the time we make it here, I don't. I'm not sure if either party is gonna be in the mood to continue driving another four to six hours to get us halfway to Vegas, like, and then get a room, and then go to bed, and then rest, and drive the rest of the way there. Like, it's easier said than done because we've already been driving around for so much for so long. You get what I'm saying? So I don't know what the fuck we're gonna do, man, but something is definitely gonna have to give. Cause if not, we'll just be forced to stay in this little town, honey, and get us a room overnight and just head out first thing in the morning. That's the only thing I can think of. Cause we already mapped out how long it will be from this little town to Nevada. And it said, I wanna say like 12 to 14 hours. Matter of fact, 14 hours, so.
Bonjour, beauty gang, 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 family. So, I am back. It has been officially a couple of hours now, you guys. As you can see, it is beginning to get dark outside. It is actually approximately 824 to be exact. And right now, it says we have just entered into Fort Stockton, Texas. But on my GPS, on the navigation screen, it's still saying that we're about 22 minutes out. 22 minutes away and so yeah i just thought i'd check in with you guys really really quick just to give you an update on that our current location where we are what we're doing so actually we're still kind of out of the city uh, we're still rolling we're still driving we're still on the road uh, yeah that's pretty much it for now beauty gang family and as you can see it's beginning to get a little dark out here now so with that being said you guys i'm not going to be able to uh probably talk to you as much shortly coming up in vlogs since it'll be it'll be you know extremely dark outside as well as inside of the car so i'll probably just check back in with you guys once we probably check into our check into our hotel suite or whatever and i got my jacket on and zipped up because we just had to pull over for a second and check his truck because he said that it felt as if his transmission was slipping and you know that ain't safe that ain't cool so yeah pray for Lee and thank god that he checked his truck and checked all his traps and everything's fine everything's okay and pray for Lee and hope to god we make it to our destination in one piece he and i including his truck work truck what the hell i've never seen no truck like that before in my life oh my god that's weird man oh god focus girl and so yeah that's pretty much it you guys and we have been driving right and now. driving for at least the past i want to say at least 40 miles and there has been absolutely nothing for like the past 30 or 40 miles you guys no rest stops no gas stations no nothing no none of that honey there's pretty much nothing out here but freaking mountains rolling rolling mountains that's all you see hopefully the closer we get to where we're going we begin to see some stuff because i'm not gonna lie this is a little creepy and so uh yeah but again that's just a quick update beauty gang family i just wanted to let you guys know where we are currently um what's going on and what we're doing so yeah we're still rolling again it says we have 20 minutes to go so pray to god we really do and that be it because i don't know how much more i can take like i said the plan was to get here drop off his work truck and freaking attempt to see if we can put in some hours to continue uh west on 10 because right now we're headed we're driving out highway 10 going west i'm not gonna say i don't see it because anything is possible through the grace of god honey but i'm gonna be honest i really just don't feel it like i don't feel good at all right now you guys my head is killing me i have a headache slash fever and i don't think it's really because of being on the road or driving or anything like that because it kind of started from earlier before we even left the room so like i said i didn't get much rest yesterday because we were bickering back and forth at each other the morning actually didn't start off too phenomenal too great yeah today has not been that great or that amazing but you know it is what it is everybody has one of those days prayfully everything gets better so with that being said you guys i'm gonna let you all go for now so i can concentrate on driving because uh, it is again it is about to start getting dark out here once we make it to our final destination and make it into town and make it into the city and get his truck dro dropped off and get all settled in you guys I'll check back in with you guys then. We'll just pick up and go from there. So, I just passed the sign that said Fort Stockton, 17 miles. On my uh, GPS, it says 18 miles. So, I don't know, but between the two, hopefully we'll be there soon. Yeah, I'll check with you all in a minute, babe. So <laughs>